They say blood is thicker than water, but my time in this country has proven this a false proverb. The bonds I've formed have gone forth to shape my own path in ways far superior to that of blood ties. With the weight of obligation off my shoulders, it was time to get back on my feet and enjoy more adventures with my real family. I always thought I would be alone in this life I chose, but the advice of a certain someone comes to mind. Be slow to fall into friendships, but when you are in, continue firm and constant. Silas? Oh, I hear him. Uh, excuse, excuse me? Are you... There he Silas? is. Silas? Oh, hey! Hey! Hello! Hello! How are you doing? I thought it was you. I just didn't want to confuse you with some, uh... Some random person again. Oh, that's all right. How you been? It's been a while. It, oh, yeah, yes. On. I've been fine. Um, how about you, friend? Doing all right. Just teaching this fellow here how to use a gun, and he's doing mighty fine. Oh, you've got the best teacher in the country. Let me tell you that. He taught me how to yeah. shoot too. And he's oh. goddamn good at it now. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I competent. couldn't even hold a gun before. Yeah, oh, yeah. Same here, friend. Don't you worry. Having a little issue. The forty-five is a little too big for him, so we're gonna do a little bit of hunting and get our hands on some money and. Then we go and grab him a little 38 special revolver. A little double action. You want to come along? If that's all right. Also, I got you a little something before we uh, leave. I, for my birthday gift, I still have a bottle left over. But but it's I your promised to, birthday? I promised, kid, I'd share it with you. Okay, well, how about you save it for later? Yep, you can save it for later. It's a good That's idea. Right, we do want to help the, the lad. Uh, I'm sorry, what was your name, friend? Oh, I'm Johnny. What's your name? Ah, nice to meet you, Johnny. I'm Aiton. Aiton Hunter. Pleasure. Nice to meet you. Aiton, would you believe it? I was, uh, I was hunting with a friend of mine, and we, we got separated, and I shot up straight into the sky like this, and a bird fell out of the sky. No, you did not. I, I, I am not joking. I have, I have a uh. witness. Well, did you do it with 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 your with your pistol, the revolver? Or I did it with, with my the rifle, rifle. Like, just like oh, this. Oh my I god! Doing this. <laughs> that is amazing. Oh. All right. Oh, yeah. you got it. That's it. Uh, uh, heavy, heavy. And I know it heavy. is. You just get it on your horse quickly. Toss him out. What the damn? Oh, there you go. Oh, oh bloody oh. hell! Oh, are you alright? Okay. Yeah, I'm just tired. Okay, one, two, three. Ah. That is not a five dollars. Oh. <laughs> oh God! What the so bloody hell? Sorry, whiskey. You're right. Why are you doing that, Somebody whiskey? get ah, oh, Johnny. Okay. Oh Lord, dear. Right. Oh my God, whiskey. Are you okay? I'm. I'm right, okay. Let me, let me I'm, okay. I'm okay. Anyway, how, how much do we need for this uh, rifle? Uh, this revolver? Uh, scale, scale. No, I, I saw what you bloody tried to do. Yeah, that's it, that's it, yes, run away! I bloody <laughs> scald you! Sc you get it? Yeah, scald, scald, no, no, what is it? What, scold, damn it, no. Yes, if you can take port, don't watch, Av walk behind the horse. Avoid horses. Yeah, yes, avoid, yeah, yes. It's very busy in here. 
Is there a doctor? Yeah, yeah. Y'all need a doctor? Yeah, there is. Uh, my friend here, sure you Johnny, he just got kicked in the face by a horse. Uh, might need to oh, get it checked okay. out, you know. Just in case he got a broken cool. nose, maybe just a uh, jaw, I don't know. Can I show you something if you promise not to tell anyone? Uh, sure. It's, uh, come with me, I gotta show you. Okay. Clear! I need the pass! It's not something dangerous now, is it? No, well, it, it's a gun. But of course it's a I gun. I managed to get my hands on a gun. It has a value of $5,000. Wait, wait, what? One? One? Yes, I hell? got a Mauser. A Mauser? What the hell is that? Look, look, I got one of these. What the hell? Oh my god. Is that... that looks... Is that it's German? German? Yes, I thought it so. Is. What the hell? Where, yeah, where did you get that from? I can't tell you, otherwise... It, if anybody knows, it'll drop in price. Oh my god. So are you trying to but sell I, it then? I have I have some, I have some. a buyer lined up for $5,000. 5000 Bloody hell. Silas, you can, you can be rich. Yes, you know what I'm going to do with that money? What's then? I'm going to renovate the cabin, add another house to it, and then you have a place to stay. Uh, you Permanently. Did, you didn't, um, Silas, I mean, you don't, have to, you don't have to do that. I mean, you know. No, you, no I do. I want to. I, I really do. But the, the cabin has enough room in it already, doesn't it? I mean, unless. unless well, yes. I, I want to give you your privacy. You know, have your own little house, your own little kitchen. If you do bring a lady back, you don't have to worry about this old snoring behemoth and room to your next. It's going to be great. Hell, and then we can invest a little bit as well. Maybe get like a steamboat. Or, uh, like a, we can rent out the parlor. Maybe make a start our own bar and you can do the music and I'll do the drinks. Hell, there's so many opportunities I don't even know. It's gonna be amazing. <laughs> yes, yes, it, 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 yeah. We'd literally be living, like, right next to each other and, and, and as you said, a steamboat and, and, and drinks and, and, and... and it could be like we, a social could, spot, you know? And about your, your I, we could, yes, I could even play, you know, special shows there. We could do shows together. We, you know, you could hell do like... Yes. I tell you what you need to do. You need to do a comedy night. Because bloody hell, man. You know, it's, it's about time. You know, I, I, I don't want to stop you from it anymore. Like, you're very funny. Even if some of those jokes were terrible. You know? I mean, most of them are terrible. But you, got, you got to go to the nastiness but, to get to the good. Yeah, exactly. I should probably go check on the fellow. Uh, yeah, yeah. Keep this to yourself. Not a lot of people know no, about no, this. No, I won't say a damn thing. You know me. My brother's still the end. It's gonna be amazing. Man. Anyway, Rich. we were talking about general, you know, um, um, food stuffs and whatnot. Hey, Gee. how you doing, Johnny? I'm okay. The the doctor said I she put just put some cold thing on my chest to reduce the uh, the the swelling. Yeah, that oh, sounds like you. Dr. Talk. Oh, when's the next time you're gonna be singing, Who's mister? Never. Singing? Uh, oh. Yeah, you said you were a musician, right? Do oh, you have I mean, a next? I had something to show Silas, if you want. No, uh, you, I'd rather not if play. Like playing saloon, no. Uh, we can use the other saloon. How about that? Yes. Let's go. I'm taking the beer with me. Okay. Have a good day, everyone. One who wears many hats. Oh. Oh. Hey. Oh, hello, Johnny. Yeah, I didn't know. It. Can we just? Oh. No, it's okay. Can we just have just a second here? Oh, so, sorry. Yes. yes. Just, yes. Just we're we're going somewhere else. We will go somewhere just else. A... All right. We, we were. Aiden was just gonna sing, and we figured we'd find a piece of place. I'm How sorry. about just right over here? I don't know whose doorstep this is, but the, I'm taking it. It is now yours for about five minutes. Hello. Hello. Anybody in there? Knock, knock. Just going to get annoyed by the racket. Ah, that'd be fine. If they didn't, if fine. they didn't want people, this, if they didn't want people singing here, ain't they should have not they had such a nice doorstep. Uh, well, uh, oh, they may not appreciate that, but here we go. <laughs> Sometimes 
All I do is cry But now the darkened days are gone They run dry Well I faced all my fears And I climbed that mountain oh so high And I thank the world for one more try What a beautiful life What a beautiful life Oh you I gave it all to you These everlasting nights that kept you from feeling blue But I I never asked you why Our hearts were sewn together Keeping the beat of two Well I faced all my fears And I climbed that mountain oh so high And I thank the world for one more try It's a beautiful life It's a beautiful life It's a beautiful life That was amazing, Aiden. Yeah. You want to die right now? Yeah, I oh bloody hell. Hey! Hey! Wait a minute! Holy shit! Don't do this! Everybody okay? Bloody hell! Can't even play a song in Valentine without somebody getting shot! Let me have a look at you. Oh dear. Uh doctor, apologies for any interruptions. It's alright, honey. What, uh, what you need? We, uh, uh gun shot. I got, got grazed in the back just a little bit. No, I know, I'm, I'm, that's why I this can, is, I can wait. Thomas, I gotta treat both Thomases for grace. Alright, <laughs> Don, you need help? I can help you. Hey, if, you yeah, if you do I the can, other I Thomas, Thomas, I got you. Alright, there we go. All right. Gentlemen. Lordy, lordy. Everyone's gonna be alright. Yeah, everybody's gonna be fine. Sorry, you had me to see me shoot that fella. Hey, hey. I mean, you know, he was trying to kill someone. Sorry, I did you see you saw him pull the gun too, right? Did when you he got out there, he did. Mr. Hunter? Somebody, somebody shot Thomas, what? though, and it wasn't that man. <laughs> One of y'all shot Thomas, by the way. Excuse you? Not this Thomas, the other Thomas. Somebody what shot Wait, yeah. the, 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 the piece yes. of man candy to my left here? Yes. Wait. So, my goodness. Funny, whoever was shooting the man uh, shot Thomas. I didn't shoot anybody. I, I was playing music. Tied him. Uh, I think he just pulled the trigger while being hug tied. Hello, Mr. Viper. Right on me. Right on me. I was How are you, kid? Head, that's I Sometimes uh, okay. I'm, I'm okay. In, oh, yes, no. I'm good. How are you, friend? Okay, um, I got worried. All right, now, right. busy, tired, no, no. I've had a headache for two nah, days it's straight. Shoot at me. It's more, you know, life. <laughs> You've been different. Refreshed, refreshed, you know? Oh, yeah, well, I you suppose know, better than the last time you saw me, yeah. Uh, definitely. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, Silas told me you're, like, doing therapy now? Uh, yes, sir. Sorry, Silas. Using my powers for good, as I say. I mean, I've always thought that, you know, you had a way with words, so... I can totally see that. If it's any yeah. proof, you kind of altered my mind and, and, and put me on the right path when I first came I here. I think the cougar did that. No, 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 <laughs> no, no, I mean, maybe. It was a part of it. You know. A little bit, you know, a little kitty cat. You know, it, it helped, I guess, you know. Absolutely. Never take what the have you been up to? I ain't seen you in the longest. Last time I talked to you, you were doing gigs for Flanagan's or something? I mean, I'm still sort of doing that. I have a contract with them, you know, and, and occasionally I've, I've been okay. to a few events, but I'm, I'm still freelance, you know, I do my own thing. Uh, Absolutely. Oh, that was good. I need another one. Jesus Christ, Silas. Be safe, Put right? him down so fast. Yeah, you too. <laughs> I heard I'm... I'm very happy to see you again, Aiden. I've been, honestly, I've been missing you a lot. Uh, Always do. But I understand that you need your space. Sometimes you gotta go around and find yourself for a bit, and that's fine. I'm just happy to see you again when you're around. Um... Silas, I need to tell you something. Uh, of course. Again, it's not the smell, is it? No, I did. no. No, it's... It's, uh... You know, 
when a while back when uh, not, we helped uh, Catherine and her friend. Um, of course, yes, I remember. Yeah, and I, I seemed a little off then, right? I got a little drunk. A bit. Something was on your mind, I could tell. I just didn't want to pry. Look, um, I got a letter from my oh. parents. You had a letter from your parents? Yeah, and um, the, my father passed away. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's fine. He was an asshole. But the, Fair the letter was about asking me to come back. I understand. And this, that's the whole reason I have been away for so long, is because I've been avoiding it. The thing is, is if I don't go back, my Uncle Robert, or Uncle Bob as we called him, bastard, Bob the Bastard, I called him. <laughs> he was a bastard. You know, he served for the Queen, he thought he was all this and all that, you know, and he wasn't. I think he just really, you know, he really wanted the money. A anyway, if I don't go back, Robert gets the company. And... If you go back, then you get the company. Yes. So... Well... I had to make a decision, I and I'm... S I was not sure about it, but after you... After today... After you showed me that... that, that gun, and... And you were willing to spend all that money just to build me a place, and... You know, and what you said back there, about family, you know? That blood runs thicker than the water... The water of the womb. womb? <laughs> it made a lot of sense. I'm not going anywhere. Hey, I'm very happy to hear that. But if you had decided to go back... I man, I would have missed you a lot. But it's your decision in the end, and I cannot pressure you into making that decision. No. I kind of didn't want to tell you. I didn't want to... I didn't want to upset you, you know? With... I mean, of course I was going to be sad, but again, it's your life, and I enjoy the time I get to spend with you. And eventually, we, something will happen to either of us, and it'll end, but... You know, I, I take the time I have right now over worrying about the future, and again, if you had to make that decision differently, then I would have had peace with it. Hell, we would have still been friends. I, I would have managed to get myself on a boat somehow, and hell, I'd, I'd come and help you with those shoes. Oh, God. I'm not any good at it, but... Oh, Lord, uh, you think I am? You think I know how to run a business? Jesus Christ, I don't, I don't know why my mother even asked me to come back. I think, well, you can do a lot more than you think you can. You put your mind to it, and... Well, um, look at what you got so far. I guess, but... You came, to a, you came to a country known to be wild and dangerous, with no knowledge of how to survive in it. And here you are, a man with a rifle on his back, self-assured in that you got one of the best jobs you can probably get. You work for a state representative you've drugged yourself to so much. And here you are. You're a lot more capable than you think you are. You put your mind to it, you can move mountains. I believe in it. <sighs> And that's the exact reason why I'm staying. Because I've I've made a new life out here. I've ma I've made friends. I've found family. Now you did. And so <sighs> Here, shut up. Thank you for being my family. The only thank family you for I've being mine. Actually, had. Oh, yeah. Okay, we should drink this. We should drink to this. Drink, 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 drink. How about how about we get a drink and then we head back up to the cabin? That Maybe sounds that's a good idea. Perfect. Cheers. To a long, happy life. Mm. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yep. That is a lot tougher than I remember. Uh, yeah. Oh, that was a tasty bit. We ought to go out west again. We should. I like it out west, you know? 
Reminds and then we can make it an adventure. Yeah, exactly. Oh, look, it's Miss Catherine. Hmm. Hello. Hello, you. She forgot your uh. name. She just doesn't want to admit it. She totally did, didn't you? Aiden. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. <laughs> she, that totally didn't take her nice five to, minutes. Nice to see you too, Catherine. Anyway, I, I'll let you two uh, be. Yes. I didn't know who was up here, sir. Wait, wait. No, please. Mm -hmm. We don't mind your company, though I do know that you're heading to bed soon, right? Yep, that's actually why we came up here. That's the same for both mm. of us. We're like two old um. men, you know? We have, like, similar <laughs> bedtimes. <laughs> he, he, he's called the Grey Man for a stage name. He's not even grey in his hair. Well, people um, call me the Grey Man because I'm grey. I'm grey and old in my mind. Oh, you're so old. <laughs> oh, We're almost tired to get her up here oh, in this cabin. We will die together. Well, it's good to, It's good to have family again. Yes, it is, isn't it? Brother. Good night. Right. <laughs> uh, 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 no, no, no. Good night. Good night. I know snore that loud again. All right then. Whoa, there we go. Time for adventure. Time oh, for it's adventure. Been so long, I've been slacking. Now, uh, just to let you know, we are getting a, a little closer to native territory with this one, but we should be all right. No, but the natives should be, f you know, uh, we, we, we're good with the natives, aren't we? Well, unless well, something's changed. Last I checked, you know, Chief Texoma, you know, he was he was, he was was friendly with us. And I, uh, I bumped into a few of them last time and was having a good time. Well, there we are then. All right then. Where are we headed, Chief? At Marino, close to the uh, Wapiti Reserve. Okay, lead the way. Should not be too hard. So how is everyone at the perch, then? Busy. Very, very busy. I can imagine so. Somebody tried to kidnap the judge, but uh, let's just say uh, it didn't go so well for them. That someone tried to kidnap Marcus, of all people. Somebody wow. want to try and kidnap him there. There's, There's cougar, cougar on our left. Hold on, it, careful! Damn it, Roger! You all right? I got him. I'm fine. I'm fine. You took a bit of a tumble, though. I'm all right. Used to it by now. Buddy Reggie, you know what he's like. Oh. 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 Get out of it! Ah! You, you alright? Oh. Oh. Yeah, on the arm a little bit. Hang on, there's more behind you, Silas! Oh, oh. Son God. Of God. Oh. Got him, there's another one! I got this, son of a... Oh no, where do you think you're going? Ah, oh, bloody good job. Okay. Where? In the cave. If I was a cave. Uh, Maybe there's an entrance through this bit here? Seems uh, like a could be. When you go up on the right and look, it's a little steep. <laughs> Do be careful. Uh, it's okay, Reggie, take his time. Yep, yeah. okay, that was a bit fast. You're confident, are you, Reggie? Oh, no, Reggie, I told you. Maybe a bit too steep, Barney. Oh. Reggie! How the, how the hell did you do that? I don't know, but that, that was scary. Let's just follow the path. Well, I, I'm, I'm putting my oh, money on. Oh, oh, God, oh, Lord. Hey, uh -oh. hey you okay? no, no, there's no need to pull your gun out now. Oh, hey, we're just here to help. It's fine. You ride off. Shit, that fellow's horse is dead. Oh no. You alright there, fella? Oh, are you alright? Can we can we offer you a lift or something? No, oh, no, I think I think he may be a bit concussed. I think he's angry. I wouldn't be surprised. I mean that that man didn't even try to move out of the way. Well, you know, I know locals is. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> hey. He is. Look on the right. Is that, is that the entrance to it? Oh, it's a hole in the rock, ain't it? 
I mean, <laughs> this right here. Over there. Can you not see it? I guess. I just see a tree. <laughs> oh my god. No wonder I couldn't see it. That is a hole in the mountain near a big pile okay. of rocks. You want to hold the gun, I hold the light? Sure. I trust you on this one. What am I afraid of? Oh shit. Oh, Lord. Shit, my lantern's wet. Well, Don't that work. definitely opened up a bit. It's not too dark in here. There seems to be some sort of light coming from above. Or maybe even through here. Oh. Uh, what the hell? Okay. The statues. This was not what I was expecting. It, it, that's a rabbit body. A rabbit with body. The wings with of a turkey. Turkey. And the head of a lady. Ugh. Why all these men stood around her? As much buttons. buttons. Or uh, holes. Uh, look, this man's missing his arm. Do you know anyone who looks like that? I didn't have a mother in law, I don't. Your mother in law? Uh, it's a, it's you were a joke. joking, right? Yeah, 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 I guess as much. Otherwise, I'd have, you know, weird turkey fingers. <laughs> okay, I think I've. Runs in the family, seen, I think we've seen enough. What do you make of all of this? I mean, I don't know. It seems like somebody, or a group of people, maybe even, used to worship some sort of deity. And this was a temple. To hold their greatest treasure. Temple of the Naked Butt Cheeks. Temple of the Naked Butt Cheek Turk Turkey Rabbit Woman. Turkey Rabbit Woman. Turkey Rabbit Woman. That's better than a rabbit turkey woman. That's that's it's a rab key woman. I don't bloody know. Come on, let's get out of here. Maybe I'll have to look in my dad's old manual. Or my grandpa's old manual. But maybe there's something about turkey lady. That might actually help. Well, if you want, I can uh, introduce you to Miguel. Miguel? Oh, yeah, he's well, the a... fellow who told you the story, right? Well, yeah. That and uh, Miguel is basically... Uh, well, he says he's from a different time. But we don't believe him. But he does kind of wear a, a weird kind of metal outfit. Okay. Uh, I mean, didn't you? Didn't, wasn't this task given to you by this Miguel? Yep. He, okay. He sent well, me to check this out. Well, let's go report it to him then. Why not? All right. We're gonna have to go up Mount Reagan. Wait, what? Yep. That's where Miguel lives. Where now? Mount Hagen. The mountain. One of them. The, There's plenty. The snowy mountains? Well, yes. Uh, okay. You know, like snowy mountains? Not after the last time we went up there. I mean, we anything? only got a little chased by an animal. Uh, by, by an animal? Done. By a something? Well. So how'd you get to meeting this Miguel character anyway? Well, let's just say I was doing a delivery mission up to north, uh, to north of Mount Hagen at one point. There used to be a group of fellas living up there called the Hagen Boys. They said it was this very angry uh, Spanish-speaking fella up at the tip of the mountain. And, well, they said he was wearing some kind of weird armor, uh, like a metal chest piece and a, and a weird feathered helmet. He didn't look very happy with me at first until I offered him a drink. Then we had a few, and uh, maybe a few more. I had a little bit too much. All I kind of remember was that he told me that he was sent here and he was from a different time. That something happened and he's trying to figure out how to get back. And that he's going to be a rich man when he does. And said he was going to carve something in the rocks. Well, that was a few months ago and he sent me a letter. So again, how far north are we going to find this? 
Miguel. Tippity top. Tippity top. Why, Try did, why, would, why would someone live all the way up here? Well, maybe he just doesn't like people. I can see that. Apparently this is, this is a road. This is a road. Apparently this is a road. I'm not high off my rocker, am I? No, no. How the hell was a horse and cart meant to make it? I don't know how I did it last time. Dumb luck? I, I don't guess know. I took a different route. Now, if the Hagen crew is out there, let me do the talking. Okay. But I doubt they'll be up here. Now, this does not necessarily look very inviting. Not really, no. Well, here's some of the supplies I brought last time. Uh, that's nice to see they've been put to use. This ain't good. What do you mean? Look at this place. It's bent. Ah, there's fire. It means Miguel's still up here. to say. There's a box of dynamite. It looks like this place has been sort of used. Where is everybody? Oh yeah, look on the left. Oh my. Okay, that wasn't there last time. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? That is rock. And it has something carved in it. I know, but I mean, what is it? It's like it looks a, like a boat. I don't know. Balloon? A very elongated balloon. Uh, what's that spiky thing below it? I don't... yes. It looks like buildings of sorts. On the left and right. You ain't wrong. I've never seen any architecture like that before, though. Hmm. This might... you think this might have been Miguel? Maybe? I mean, you said he wasn't from this time, right? Well, he said he wasn't from this time, but... That's, that was not there last time I was up here. Really? No. Miguel! He likes him up here. Right said here? He, well, somewhere up here. Oh, oh, oh. careful, Silas. God. Damn it. Did you really come this far out? I mean, God, Jesus Christ, oh this place is so slippery. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, you right? I'm sliding! Whoa! Oh, did you see that? Holy hell, that was hell and hell of a sliding. Oh, oh my God! Miguel. Silas! What? Silas! Oh, Silas, look! Miguel. Oh shit! That is Miguel? Miguel? Uh, he don't look too good. So of course he doesn't look too good, Silas. He looks frozen to death. Oh my god! Well, well that what is Miguel. He, what would he be doing? I thought you said he just liked it to sit. Well, he liked to sit up here. For how long? I don't know. Usually a few hours. But usually there was a fire. What the hell? I know this is going to sound odd, but he kind of looks... Like he's been dead for a while? Yes. Yeah, his armor didn't used to be that rusty. And I doubt metal rusts from being frozen, especially not no. that fast. I mean, the last time I saw him was a few months ago, but this looks like he's been dead for longer than a few months. Oh my god. Where's his hat? Oh, he had a hat? He had a big helmet. 
in, in the shape of a the front of a boat. It had a big purple feather on it too. Do you think somebody stole it? Do you think it's those Hagen boys? I mean, I wouldn't put it past him. They did not like the feather, and he was not necessarily friendly to him. But they didn't strike me as the type of people that kill a man for a hat, especially. They may know. have beaten him up for it, but they wouldn't have killed him. What the hell is he doing up here then? Surely this man well, wouldn't let himself die up here. It looks like he's pointing at something. Or is that just me? Look at his hand, his right hand. He's definitely looking at something. He's just pointing out there though. Maybe he saw something. Hmm. Well, there. Uh, if you don't mind, I'm gonna see if he still has my fifty dollars. Of course. What the hell was he looking at? God, he's frozen solid. He does have a book. A book? Well, I mean, it looks like a book. What is, is it? Like a journal or something? Have a look. Well, let me have, let me grab it then. No. Yeah. Oh God. Uh, th that don't look good. What do you mean? It's a book like this usually doesn't rot, especially not in a cold place. What would normally happen? Well, it would get wet. And it would get soggy. But it wouldn't... This looks like it's it's ancient. Can you make out anything inside of it? Uh, it looks like... Latin. Like the Bible uh, language. Great. I can't bloody speak Latin. No, me neither. It, actually, I... The outside of this book is the same color as that piece of letter back in the uh, in, in the that cave? cave, and it's the right size. Wait, do you think Miguel was the one who took it, the book from there? It could be. Maybe that's why he asked me to go down there, but instead of you know waiting for us, he went himself. He must have been awfully fast about it. If that's the case, then maybe... Well, I mean, I, I got the note a few weeks ago, and maybe he sent it a long time ago. It, it depends. Uh, maybe it didn't get to me fast enough. Or he got somebody else to get it for him. Hmm. Well, obviously somebody else knew about this book, then. Well, um, it, it's a mess, but uh, maybe we can ask Gabriel to read it. All right. It's our best bet. Well, if you want, the fire's still burning. We can hmm. warm up a little. That would be good. Well, I mean, there's even a little shack over one. there. Well, maybe we can find something useful. Look like the Hagen boys moved on. <laughs> yes, doesn't look like anyone's using this place. Oh, be before you do, back up for a second. But why? If this dynamite has been abandoned for a very long time, and they haven't turned it, that means the nitroglycerin in the uh, sticks of dynamite has sunk to the bottom. Okay, meaning? Which means if you gently knock it or something falls or something hits it, it's going to blow up. Ah. Uh. You ready? Yes. Oh! oh, my God. That was a lot more dynamite. That was way more than you said. Uh. Oh. Oh. I think I'm on fire. Alright, yeah, I think you're a little uh, too close to- Oh, uh, wait! Oh, uh, damn it! Uh, oh, shit! Uh, oh, wait, uh, oh, my god. Yep. Ah. yep. Oh, god. That's not good. God damn it. Uh, I think if I take it down there. Uh, strawberry might be closest. Unless you wake up along the way.
Colt, you're just down there. Hey, oh, shit. Oh, ow. I'm going to have to risk it for a biscuit here. Nah, it's way too steep. Ain't no way I'm going to get down there in one piece. Nah, this looks like a safe way. Oh, ow. I'm so sorry. You're going to be all right. You're going to be all right. God damn it, this place is slippery as hell. Hold on. At least you're going to be, well, cooled down from those burns. Screw off. Okay. Aiden, listen here. I'm going to put you down when we get close, and I'm going to see if I can commandeer me some one of them horses. I know it's a far fetch, but it's worth the try. All right, I'm going to put you here, down here by this river. I'll be back for you, all right? Don't leave. Whatever you do, stay here. I'll be right back, Aiden. I think I got one. Hold up. I got one. How did it damn wait? All right. I'm going to gently put you down. And there it is. How you feeling? Uh, there you are. I am uh, so sorry. Uh, what are you sorry for? Oh, You're caught on fire. It wasn't your bloody fault, was it? No, but oh. everything afterwards was. Oh. What happened afterwards? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it was a stupid thing. I, I sat way too close to the fire. And then when I was on fire, I ran and I tripped over that bloody log and then I can't remember what happened. You hit your head pretty hard. I, I managed did. to get rid of the fire by covering you in snow. Well, Carried well, you all the way down the mountain. Well. I tried to catch one of the wild horses and... Uh, <laughs> Look, you, you did your best, and you got me here alive. Wait, where the hell are we? Strawberry. Oh. All About the way to 20 strawberry. miles. 20 Man. miles south. Oh, um, mm. Yeah. Oh. Yes, I ran. Most that of that amazing. way. That's amazing. Yeah, I am yet absolutely again, exhausted. Saving my life from my own stupidity. I mean, that was not your fault. It kind of was, though, wasn't it? Well, he wasn't cold anymore, was he? No, I'm actually quite warm now. Yeah, I did I apply I'll... some burn salve. You burned your upper arm a little bit. Your uh, coat caught most of it. Uh, fair play to the coat, then. You goddamn son of a bitch scared <laughs> to piss out of me, you did. I'm sorry. No, no need to be sorry. I was adventure. I've missed this feeling. The feeling of lighting yourself on fire. The feeling of lighting myself on fire. I, uh, oh. oh, my head. So I'm a little lightheaded, I'll be honest, but I'll be fine. How about we take you to that uh, hotel down here? Oh, yes, I've never actually gotten to stay here. You got the fancy suite. With the bath. Go wash yourself off. Oh, yeah, a bath would be nice right now. It's been bloody good.
Oh, except the burdens. Except for the burdens, but you know, better come away with some battle scars. At least you still got your stash. And yes, I've still got my stash. 